Assalamu alaikum and welcome back to my channel and today we are going to be learning something different from crocheting and this um, this video that I'm showing was requested specially by my best friend and I'm going to show you how to do a cross stitch stitching this is a lesson for beginners and it is very easy to make um, um, as you know that I have learned different several kinds of stitching before so it wasn't hard for me for but you know every but i would like to say that as i'm a crochet crochet is typically the worst type of um, see uh, stitchers in the world we don't know how to stitch or we don't know how to save and it will be the most disgusting time when anyone says you that so for this video i'm going to show you how to do a cross stitch this is a very easy stitch and yeah let's get let's begin to this Okay, to make this, you need a, uh, this, a piece of fabric, you need a needle and some thread. I'm using this type of thread, I'm using yellow color thread so that you guys can see it on camera. This camera keeps shaking here and there. <laughs> That's so funny. Okay, after you have thread your needle, what you are going to do is, you're going to bring the two ends together. These are your two ends, look at this. These are your two ends, you are going to bring them together and make a knot. And to make a knot, it's same like the slip stitch, but I mean slip knot. Yarn over, wrap your yarn across your fingers like an X. Then, like an X, catch the X, pull this loop and put the end into the loop. Oops, into the loop and then off you go this is how it cre creates the knot okay i like to make only one knot that is enough for me <laughs> after so many years i have took my needle and my fabric and i'm getting started to make the stitch so it will be a little hard to show but it's okay okay what i'm going to do now is I'm going to take my needle that is right here and go into like I'm going inside inside the fabric from where I want to come up across wait I'll just choose another spot yeah and then up okay now what I like to do is I'm going to go up right here I guess I have to choose here. Yeah. It would be like this. You can also go like this or you can go like this. I would choose like this. And just let me choose right here. Go into this. Now it creates a diagonal line. It's great a di diagonal line. Now what I like to do is I like to get it through the same hole I came up like I want to make the diagonal same right here it should be like this so I want to keep my needle right here so for that I'm going to come across okay I have kept my needle right there now I'm going to come up now I want to go up right here so this is easy so what you're going to do is you're going to go right here to make an another diagonal line that is really far to make an another line go right into there this creates your X this creates your cross stitch and now mine is like <laughs> a little bit bumpy or something but as you know, I'm a crocheter. Results may be a little bad. Yeah. Now, what I like to do is my thread is um, inside. So this is my inside part. It would look like this. It's okay. You can just. I like to go. I'm going to go up through. I'm going to go in this direction here 
right here like you're going to go from this x that you recently made not i mean the you are going to go in the next i mean the x the diagonal line that you made earlier and this is the recently one so your angles should be same i mean your angles should be equal mine are not because it was um after so many years i took my needle and a fabric to sew go up like this come up i'm not showing you how to measure the angles or what you have to do that yourself now go in this direction you're going to go in the same direction like that so go down this creates your first diagonal this is your first diagonal you see that then i like to go here near to my this leg of the x the next diagonal line that i made recently made that one go up in this direction go down like that this creates your x you can see how my x are <laughs> Um, as you know that I took my needle and my thread after a long time and it was a little hard to do for me all this work but I however made it because my friend requested I don't want to be and I wanted to make the tutorial as soon as possible um, thanks for watching guys I hope this video was helpful and please like comment share and subscribe and your request shall be accepted my friend requested today and I keep made the tutorial today wow her luck is good and Thanks for watching. Bye guys.